everybody for joining our quick five minute demonstration for Willa's full stack visibility and correlation for the use case of troubleshooting, application dependency mapping, migration, optimization, security analy analytics, and so on. So um, without further ado, let's just jump right into it. So what do we mean by full stack visibility? It is being able to see and gain the visibility for the entire data center multi-cloud operation from the top of the stack, which will be the application, the application dependency mapping, the end user experience, right? As represented by kind of this particular circle, everything about the applications, right? particularly the application performance, of course, and then from top of the stack of the application going down the stack, certainly there is networking, there's CPU, there's memory, there's storage. And then that's also including networking devices represented by the infrastructure part of our solution. So that's kind of the lower of the applications, right? particularly the application performance, of course. And then from top of the stack of the application going down the stack, certainly there is networking, there's CPU, there's memory, there's storage, and then that's also including networking devices represented by the infrastructure part of our solution. So that's kind of the lower part. So um, with this visibility, what is important about it? Um, so Nick, if you could help me mute some of the uh, paper shuffling noise, if you could mute. Jeff, could you mute your, uh, your microphone? Ah, thank you. Cool. So um, what do we mean by um, application dependency mapping, right? With, or the uh, full stack visibility, it's all about, you know, from the application level down to the infrastructure. Then, you know, I'm sure you guys have a lot of tools that's already helping you seeing the networking, seeing the CPU memory and storage, even for the multi-cloud environment. But what we particularly mean for full stack visibility is not just being able to see it to the greatest detail, but also being able to correlate it together. So let me quickly show what do we mean by that. So in terms of from the application level mapping down, it would be from the application dependency mapping, such as a you know map like this that will give you the application dependency from your front end to your back end server. That is the application level visibility. Horizontally, you see the application dependency. But also not only the application dependency from the front end to the back end, but how does the whole thing relates to your infrastructure and be able to correlate that from the application performance to the underneath infrastructure. So that would be, for example, as you notice, some of the web server may have some lower performance that's indicated by full stack capability indicating to you HTTP is responding slow and correlating that HTTP application performance, such as all these red bars you see here, be able to map it out to the bottom of the stack. That would be the infrastructure, the CPU, the memory, the storage provisioning. Are they negatively impacting the top of the stack application performance or there may be other horizontal impact of the application dependency downstream server, such as MySQL services provided by DB Server 3 or DNS services provided by you know, somebody outside of your gateway. They all could impact your application performance. So all these components, are the full stack visibility components because they impact your front end application performance. And with all these applications, with all these visibility, with this full stack, let's not forget 
the application response time certainly can be impacted by the application itself. So how do we get the application visibility? That is the down below the application transaction that we're able to grab it for you, where it will show you what are the slowdown application transaction, right? So in the end, this full stack capability, the full stack correlation is certainly, you know, helping you do troubleshooting, to do optimization, root it out the most difficult dependency issue to find the application performance bottleneck. So this way, from the visibility, from the application level down to the infrastructure dependency and infrastructure root cause, is surely one way to look at the full stack visibility and correlation. There are certainly cases where you will go the reverse direction. That means from, from the networking side, from the networking devices, or from CPU, memory, or storage performance, you want to be able to correlate the infrastructure performance back to the application. So for example, from the networking standpoint, you will want to be able to not only see the networking performance, which again, I believe you guys probably have some tool to help you look at networking performance, but you do certainly want to be able to map the application performance back to application. For example, all these nodes, all these virtual machines or physical server, what application do they run? What is the application response time when they don't run well? How has networking negatively impacted your application performance and which one, right? So for example, we're looking at data, uh, database load balancer, you can quickly identify it's running an application called iPerf and all these networking parameters are there like you already may have but the, net, the application contact is there for you to see. Likewise, looking at networking devices from the bottom up approach, from the bottom of the stack, you will see all the switches, you will see all the ports, you will see all the port statistic, that's no magic, but mapping from the physical port level up the stack to what are the servers that's plugged into the physical port. Of all these servers, this particular web server, what is its dependency mapping, right? This is the physical or virtual server plugged into this physical port. What is the downstream application dependency? What is the CPU memory and storage provisioning of this particular web server that is plugged into this networking? What is the application response time of this web server? All these our data center delivery objective, the service delivery. And this is the full stack from, again, the application performance, the networking performance, the application dependency down below to the CPU memory storage server infrastructure parameters with all the details from application conversation to the, all the way down to the CPU memory storage provisioning details that you want to be able to have your fingertip be able to access to it as quickly as possible. So without further ado, I think this is the, a quick five minute demo about our full stack application visibility for the use case of troubleshooting uh, and infrastructure and application full stack optimization, planning, migration, security analytics type of use case. So with that, um, thank you very much for joining me for this very short five minute demo.